gentlemen. Dave seems to be struggling to figure out a way to get his headset on. Oh my god, this is so silly. Alright. Welcome back to the Nodwick Games Room. This is Naked Dave. And Nodwick. And I've got a cable sticking out of my head. Good enough. Alright. We're picking back up with Final Fantasy VI. Yes. Yeah. Alright, I got my bear hat on. I'm ready for this scene. Yep. We're gonna commit murder. Oh, that's interesting. They changed her sprite here. This is what happens to traitors. So in uh, the Super Nintendo version, they had this sprite of her like chained up like this, hanging on the wall because they're interrogating her. Yeah. I wonder why the fuck they changed that. Now Magitech they're... Knight, forged by the Empire and tempered in battle. None have ever truly known the woman beneath the general's guise. Celeste. Uh, I've always liked her character, too. Looks like they've got her hands bound behind her back. Yeah, a little bit. So. Alright, uh, you can do the guard voice. So the mighty Celeste has fallen. Ah! Not as far as those who'd uh, use their strength to oppress the weak. Quiet. Kafka's planning to poison every last man, woman, and child in the kingdom of Doma. Shut up! Huh. Run that mouth of yours while you still can. Your execution's tomorrow. Keep a close eye on her. Yes, sir! I can stand guard for days without sleep! You're gonna get the shit kicked out of you is what's gonna happen. Well, oh, she faints. <laughs> Locks hidden up in the rafters. I love it. Yeah. Well, that was just not nice. Yeah. Yep. For days. Cute bucket. Remove her bindings. Of course. And you are. Name's Lock. I'm with the Returners. You're a Returner? I'm... Or at least I was. General Celeste. Now I'm nothing but a traitor. Well, let's get going. Hmm? You take me with you? No, I can barely walk. I'd never make it out of here. I appreciate it, but even if you got me out, you wouldn't be able to protect me. I'm better off waiting here for the Executioner. At least that way I'll keep my pride. I'll protect you. Trust me, you'll be fine. A little wink. Let's go. Wait. I soldier might have something uh, we could use. Let's check him out. There's a clock key in his pocket. Stealing is wrong. Stealing is wrong for our thief character. Of course I'm gonna take it. Eddie wakes up. More soup and mumble, mumble. He doesn't wake up for long. <laughs> no. Oh, that's funny. What an idiot. <laughs> Handy Convenient. dandy save point. <laughs> Conveniently placed save point. Well, did it say Celeste is a rune knight? Rune knight, yeah. I thought it was called runic knight, but uh, that's just me. Here you go. Have a missile sword. Better than having nothing equipped. Yep. Oh, chest. We just walked by a chest, Dave. Oh, I did too. It's all blended into the uh, to the boxes. Yeah. 500 gil. Glad I went back for that. Oh, two more chests. Empty? Why did they bother putting an empty chest? I don't know, it seems like a tease. It's an old clock. Yeah, let's wind it. There we go. Fucking hidden doors everywhere. Gotta love these old puzzle dungeons. Da, 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 da. What's down here? Another chest. Iron armor. Oh, buddy. That should be better for her. Oh, she's already got it. Well then. And we probably can't wear it. Hey, battle? 
Oh, shit. Vector Hound and a Commander. Install the potion. I only scratched the surface. Stop that before I hit you. The whole scene is getting grisly. <laughs> oh, it's a Kodiak moment. Get to those. Oh, Maybe yeah. somewhere down here. More fucking commanders. Hey, somebody leveled up. Yep. Wonder if it was Pikachu. <laughs> oh man, I hated these. I hated this maze. No, so this is a dead end. Yeah. And I see stairs. Right, uh... I mean, there's tons of treasure chests down here. The shitty bosses, or battles, though. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be back once we figure out the maze. Why are you helping me? You remind me a lot of someone. What's it matter anyways? I'm helping you because I want to. Peace! We're free! We're free! Yay! Oh, we don't want to go there. What, that little hut? Yeah. No, we don't want to go there. We want to go to a cave. What's that little hut? I was what, uh, Duncan's house. Oh, uh, okay. I don't need to go there. I'll go in the cave. I'm gonna get through this area here. Wait, isn't this the same cave that we did the Koopo fight? Uh, no, no, it's not, but it's... Um, I mean, all the caves have the same layout. And all the caves also have the same music. Yeah. And by layout, I mean, like, uh, they're, they're using all of the same chipset. Yeah. All the same images. Sometimes the palette's swapped up a little bit, but but not very often. Yeah. Come on. Whoa. Jeez. I don't remember running into the gold bear last time. He's got some health. He That's... must be my cousin. Yeah. Bye-bye, cousin bear. You bear a resemblance. Yeah, I barely knew him. <laughs> oh god, how far are we gonna stretch this? <laughs> if it's not I figured we would just stick with the bear essentials, but <laughs> the bear necessities. Uh, if it's not innuendos, it's horrible puns. Folks, you'll have to bear with us. <laughs> uh, Let's drink a nice cool bear. Octo Turtle. What, what is that, that noise? That's a good question. Recovery Spring! Sounds like a rock slide to me. What is that? Something's coming from the wall. Oh, right, the boss battle in here. Whoa. Tunnel Armor! That thing hits us with its magic. Blah, blah, blah. So what we're supposed to do, this is our, um... Our tutorial for how uh, runic works. Gotcha. So we do this, and then we hit runic. So that way, any magic that it uses, she absorbs. Steal from it. Yoink. Another air knife. It's actually good. I keep using runic. There we go. And then we just pummel it until it falls down. Come on, use magic to make it worth it. There it goes. Excuse me, that's mine now. And I just keep doing this until it falls. Yeah, because she'll actually draw the magic towards her. Yep. And then he'll just keep punching it. Stop doing basic attacks. It's bogus. Eh. Ha! That'll learn you. I love, the, I, I love the little shield animation. Yeah. Jeez, he was not a tough boss at all. No, I remember it being tougher the first time yeah. I played this. 
get an extra attack round in there. Yeah. Although, Yay! I've never been the type to overly level my characters either. Whew. Finally in the clear. Yeah. Are we gonna come out of those... Oh, jeez. We beat a scenario already? Yeah. That was a small scenario. I guess it's uh, more difficult if you don't know what you're doing. True. Fleeing the Empire's troops, Bannon, Edgar, and Terra ride the rapids towards Nush. But the going won't be easy. Because Edgar is a creep. Well, yeah. Lecherous bastard. Do we have another fish boss? I hope not. Oh, crossbow attack. Because that guy was hey. annoying. Fucking Ultros. I love Ultros. He kills me. I have to fight him like three times in this game. What? Yeah. And uh, are his puns always the same? Oh, well, not the same, but they're always just as bad. <laughs> Yay! Bannon gained a level. Fish soup is not on the menu. You're not a fish. You're a cephalopod. Alright, just going down the river. Yeah. Minding my own business. Alright. So that wasn't so bad. No. I thought they said this was going to be a difficult trek. Uh, maybe they weren't expecting us to be such a high level. No one ever expects the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> oh. John C. Ah. Please, I can explain. Get out of here now, or you'll regret it. He's punching old man. Let's not get hasty here. I'm King Edgar of Figaro. Liar. My goodness. And that, my friends, is why I can't stand men. It's like they don't even have ears. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. I love how you stopped giving female voices to other females, but you kept Terra. Well, I got to vary it a little bit. Ooh, who be that? No, he doesn't matter. When Locke first rescued me, we came out of the mines right around here. He fiddled with something. I think it was his penis. <laughs> yes, he told me, twist this stone like so, and... Twist your stones like so. Cradle the balls, work the shaft. Fondle, fondle. Alright, now up through <clears throat> this fucking section here. We gotta beat up some terrifying mice. And what's up with Edgar? Oh, we blinded. Oh, okay. But it doesn't matter because his auto crossbow hits like every time anyway. That's why I haven't bothered to heal him. Alright, and then I gotta come around here and then fucking. fucking. gonna uh, come up here. Was it through here? Can't remember. Oh, neither can I, so this is the way I'm gonna go. This is promising. I'm, I'm going somewhere. Yeah. So. Oh, you know what I need to do when this battle's over? Optimize two or two of the three of our characters. Yep. There's no point to optimize Bannon. Nope. Because all he does is pray. Yeah. Quip. Optimize. Boop. Boop. Wait. I can't even optimize Bannon. No. I can't do anything else with him. Alright. So, boop and boop. All the dupers were boopered? Hey, a save point. Um... That's moving. Oh, fuck me. Do we have to remember that pattern? I think so. This must be the place. What place? There's a room in here they use to test applicants to the city guard. We should be fine as long as we follow the light. If we make a mistake, lights will surround us. Then we'll have to tag the glimmering orange light to proceed. What is this train you in? So it was up like nope. And no. 
This could get annoying. Thought it was an God damn. Oh. Almost tagged it. Yeah. Jesus! What the fuck are those? Dark side. We fought those on the train. E pray love! Get some health! Murder some fucking ghosts! Alright. Alright, show me it again. So it's doodly doot, doodly doot, and then up and doot, and down and doot. Doot, and then doot and doot, doodly doot. Alright. So you got it now? Probably not. And then it was doot, and then doot, and then doodly doot. Yeah. And then down past the doot. Yeah. And then up. Through the doot. And through the doot, and past this doot, and then doot. Yeah. Got it. Alright. See, when I was a kid, I used to think that these weird mouth things were on their stomach, and that the red part was a hat, like their ear was a hat, and their other ear was their snout. What? Yeah, I, I don't know why, I just had a weird view of that sprite as a child. That rat thing? Yeah. I think we doot this doodle, and we poop this doot. Do we gotta shoop this whoop? Is this the whoop that we shoop? I don't remember. Oh! The Moogaloops! Koopo! Koopo? Ho! Are we supposed to go into the home of the Koopos? I don't know. Bloomblade. What's it do? Sword that draws MP from its wielder to deal criticals. Cool. Why the fuck not? Alright. That was an interesting side quest. So we shoot that whoop. Found another save point. Yeah, and we've already looted all of these chests when we came here with Locke. Ho ho ho! Yeah! So, if I'm understanding the Runic Blade correctly, it's that we'll get a critical hit every time as long as we have MP. Yep. I am okay with that. Not I mean, it should go on a character who we use no magic on, but I haven't really used magic on her. Except for on some of the bosses, I guess. But getting critical hits is also going to be super nice. Yeah, she's a beefcake. There we go. These shitty enemies. Yep. Now we get through this section here. And then... Alright, I think this is where we're going to leave it, folks. we got yes. a good time length for this episode. We really do. If you like what you're seeing, make sure you give that button. The electric spike. Like, comment, and growl. All those good things. <laughs> this is Nate. <laughs> <laughs> you are not Negative. For the last time. <laughs> this is Negative. And Nodwick. And we'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye! <laughs> you're not Negative. <laughs> we